just like that. Oh, he puts it in. One, two, three. He makes it quick and easy. Fantastic goal, really it was. Manchester slides through. Oh, he's got a man through a goal here. It's a stunning goal from Ovi. What's going on everyone? My name is Ovi and welcome to a new FIFA 20 tutorial on the channel. Guys, today we're going to talk about the drag to drag, a four star skill move. A skill move that is used by a lot of pros. It is very good this year, but you just have to know when and how to use it. Before getting started, make sure to smash the like button. Let's try and get over 1200 likes. If you love the tutorial series on the channel, if you want to see more tutorials going live ASAP. So the drag to drag. It is a four star skill move. It can be performed by pressing and holding LT on your PlayStation controller or LB on your Xbox One controller and then doing a fake pass or a fake shot without moving the left analog, without pressing at all the left analog. Don't be fooled by this example right here when I've got pressed also R1. It is just a visual glitch of the live controller. Why is the drag to drag such an effective move? First of all, the ball is kept close to the body of your player. Uh, it gives you a neutral position once you've done this skill move. So you're moving, uh, you're running with the ball. Once you've done this skill move, you stop and you keep the ball very close to your body. You change a bit the tempo of that certain play. It is fantastically good to use in pressure situations. Let's say that uh, the defender is rushing at you. You can fool him with his if you use this type of of skill move the drag to drag after that you can get past the defender get into a shooting position put a shot in score that's very decisive and very important goal as i was telling you in a previous video the drag to drag is a great move to use also from the wing it gives you the opportunity guys to switch the ball from the uh, left foot to the right foot of your player or from the right foot to the left foot of your player just setting up the ball from a bad angle to a position from where you can use the finesse shot at the far post this is great this is a great skill to use over there it also gives you time to cut inside not only that you can dribble past defenders on the wing using the drag to drag getting into a position from where you can put a pass inside the penalty box last but not least it gives you time it offers you the opportunity to control the pace of the game of the possession when you are using the drag to drag you can slow down a bit the game uh, you can keep possession of the ball, you can wait for your players to get into different attacking situations. It's also great to use in front of the penalty box against drop back opponents. They have a lot of players there, they uh, defend passively and the drag to drag is a great move to use over there and it will help you a lot guys. All you have to do is check the examples from this video, learn how to do it. Afterwards, go in a few friendlies, test it over there, master it. So once you go into division rivals and for champions, you're gonna be used to it and you're gonna get the maximum out of the drag to drag. A very nice and effective move. This will be all for today. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to drop a like. My name is Ovi and I'll see you guys later.